All right, what's going on, YouTube, man? It's your boy, Stunning Guys. Now, in today's video, man, we'll be going over what is the best overpowered Craigslist loadout in Warzone, man. And listen, man, I'm not going to lie to you guys. The gameplay that you're seeing a little bit was absolutely insane, man. We dropped the 20 bomb guys in solo duels, man. And you guys are going to see on why you should actually use this loadout, man. The Craigslist is probably like a gun that you would never, ever see anybody use. It's very rare just because there's so many metas that's going around, you know, with the MAC 10s and all that good stuff. But yeah, hope you guys do just today's video, man. Let's try to get a like up. 50 likes, man. If this video gets 50 likes, guys, I'll post another Warzone video for you guys because you guys been seeming to like it on my channel. All right, but without ado, man, let's go get started with what is the best Crixus loadout in Warzone. I'm out. Peace. All right, guys, so we are back on the channel. I'm about to go ahead and give you guys pretty much the no recoil overpower on um, Crixus loadout in um, Cold War um, Warzone, man. Listen, listen, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. This gun legit has zero recoil. It's pretty much matches like the Kilo 141. But in my opinion, guys, I'm not going to lie to you. I don't know what it is with Cold War weapons, but it feels like that almost that Modern Warfare weapons in general just do not stand a chance against Cold War weapons. I mean, let, let me know down in the comments section if you guys feel like that um, also. But let's get started with what is the best Crixis loadout in Warzone. So, pretty much, man, for our muzzle, guys. Now, like my last video, like I said, if you are not running the agency, the agency um, suppressor, which is pretty much similar to Mon Suppressor, on your ARs or subs, man, you are missing out, guys. I'm I'm telling you guys, please use the agency suppressor, bro. It does help out a, a ton. You guys just don't know, all right? So make sure you guys are rocking that bad boy. And for your barrel, guys, man, now, listen. So we pretty much was looking to see what we... Now, I'm going to give you guys, like, a backstory about the Craig 6. Now, the Craig 6 is already a no-recoil gun. It's pretty much just like the Kilo, but it better, you know what I mean? So listen, guys. Rock the 19.7 inch takedown barrel. Now, the reason why we are doing this, guys, is just because um, we pretty much get that little effective damage at range and all that good stuff, okay? I was trying to look to see if there's like a barrel to see if I get that little nice bullet velocity along with the damage range, but it's literally none, it's literally none of that at all whatsoever. But I got something that's gonna fix your accuracy and all that, but we care about range and accuracy and all that good stuff on this channel, especially if you are using AR or subs in general, okay? So make sure you guys are rocking the 19.7 inch takedown barrel okay and um for your ammunition guys now listen Rock this side was 60 round fast man guys i'm telling you you'll literally clear out an entire team with probably with one clip literally trust me guys you literally would do that just because the crisis kills so so fast i kind of feel like that the crisis kills so fast to the point where that enemy won't even have time to react to like what's even going on at that very moment okay so make sure you guys are rocking that salvo 60 round uh fast mech okay and for your optic guys man you want to make sure that you go all the way down to the micro flex led man we, are, we will always rock the micro flex led just because it is so op i'm i'm not gonna lie to you now for some reason like i said in my last video my, my my last warzone video i personally do not like running these certain optics over the case just because i still have yet to find which one is the best one other than the microflex led which one i just tend to use just because i just feel it's just comfortable with using it you know what i mean i just feel very very good so that's that's the important thing about warzone you know and try to get um wins or just high kills in general you need to use something that you are very very comfortable with. and i found out that me using this optic for the microflex led um actually just gives me everything that i want so make sure you guys are rocking that bad boy Okay, and let's go to let's go down to your underbarrel real quick. Now for your underbarrel, guys, man, we are actually rocking the XFOD speed grip. Now you see right here, we pretty much got that sprint move speed along with that horizontal recoil control. Like I said, man, we all about recoil control on this channel. So make sure you guys are rocking that bad boy. Okay. Now this is pretty much the Craigslist class of the bright here. Hope you guys do enjoy today's video, man. It's your boy Stan, guys. I love you guys so much. And yeah, let's get started with today's video. I'm out. Peace. Kids had a bag on them too, kinda. Whoa. Just had no money. They have me sighted. Ah. 
Oh, he a sniper. Be advised, UAV is bingo fuel. Oh, you gotta be kidding me, right? Oh, fuck. I didn't think he saw me. Let's go. Man, I said thing I ain't seen you. What? I didn't already fight somebody. Get that guy. I need recon of the area. Over. UAV entering the AO. Closing in. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Wait. No. Oh my gosh. Do what? What was that about? Oh my gosh. All that stadium. I'll drive. I'll take the wheel. Be advised, you wait.
Wait, what? No, what? Oh my gosh, there's no way that just happened to me. Oh, uh, why did I do that? There was no need for that. No way. Oh no, I choked that. How many kills did I have that game? 20, I had 20. <laughs> That's tough, man, GG.